What's going on guys? Today I'm going to be showing you uh, how to like sample your own voice in like uh, in your own beats so like as you uh, I don't know how to explain it if you like if you make like a beat and then like you just want to like have some vocals in the background and instead of like getting it out of arcade or contact or something like that and uh, you want to add your own vocals then uh, that's what I'm going to show you today so so I already got this finished beat right here and uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out these vocals that I added in before and like I said we're going to add our own we're going to add our own vocals as like samples what I do I usually just record the vocals on the melody itself so what I'm going to do is just only have the melody play and uh, then I'm going to open up another one add a microphone while well, well, on so now I have a microphone added here as you can see and uh, on another channel what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna add uh, some effects so the first two things I add is uh, a fruity compressor I just put down these you can copy that and uh, Maximus is just to like cut out the S's like the two sharp ones after that I usually add an EQ and I'll mess with that after I put down the vocals and sometimes I'll add a low uh, love filter we'll see after and some reverb which I'll also mess with after we've put down the vocal so after that it's up to you you have to put down some type of vocals um, I'm just gonna quickly do something see how that sounds so I'll press record and then I'll just come up with something random one two three four five Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, twenty, two, twenty, three. So after you put down the first part of vocals, I think this is pretty bad, I might have to redo that. But uh, what I'll do is you can just root it to that track number four with all the effects on it. It's number 13 here. And then the first thing I usually do is because my voice is pretty bad. So what I'll also add is some auto tune and uh, I have a waves tune. And then first thing I do is just put it on the right key. F sharp minor is this one. I'll just put a bit of it on. It always depends what you want to do with the track. So what I'll do is I'll just put on auto tune. I'll usually also pitch up my voice just, uh, yeah, just to make it sound better and then uh, so I pitch mine up to 700 as you can see then after that I'll probably put on a lot I'll put the size up take the dry down push this up these two and then put that on a bit I like to do the telephone effect a lot of the time or I'll put on some the, the fruity love filter and right now what I'll do with this one is I'm gonna cut out the lows and the highs a bit and see how it sounds suck my ass suck my ass Okay, so this part right here, I'm talking shit by the way, I don't know. Okay, so I'm saying suck my ass here. <laughs> this part right here, this actually sounds okay if I was saying something proper. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to take the eco, I'm going to put it even more. Because I was going to take down the volume quite a bit. So something like this. Also, sometimes I put some delay on it just so it like doesn't end so abruptly. That helps a lot. I usually set it to like four steps and then put down the volume a bit. Okay, so this part right here is also pretty far. It actually sounds pretty good. I'm just saying, like, I don't know what I'm saying. But, so yeah, I mean, that's pretty much how I do it. Like, there's other tricks, like, you can, uh, instead of using the EQ, put on the love filter. And then just, like, uh, depends how you want it. But, like, for example, here, just put it around there. To be honest, I don't think that sounds as good. Maybe add the uh, telephone effect right here. So yeah, it's, it sounds uh, okay. Um, if you have a better voice, obviously it will sound better. So if you don't, add auto-tune. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty much how I add the samples itself. Uh, yeah, because even if you have a bad voice, you can somehow make it sound fire. Just mess around a lot. It doesn't always sound good at the first time, but you just mess around with it. Mess around with your voice. You can always pitch it up, down. You can also pitch it like, for example, you can pitch it all the way down to 700. And uh, see how it sounds then. I mean, that sounds pretty far too. It always depends what you're going for. Yeah, it just like, see what works. Check out my main channel with all the beats on there. Subscribe here. Check out the other tutorials. Let me know if you have any video ideas. And uh, subscribe and peace.